When is your friend Betty coming? She should be here any time soon. Here she comes. Hi Buzz. Hi, I am Betty. Hi Betty. Buzz told me you are coming to visit him. Hey Betty. Here's your favorite honey. And you know, I was teaching Amber about numbers less than 1000 it was so much fun wow so you know big numbers right amber but i haven't taught him how to read the numbers okay no problem i'll teach him can you tell me what is this number amber oh sure it's 25 yes correct and it is written like this Now consider this number. Can you tell me the place value of each digit? Yes, the digit three is in the hundreds place. Digit two is in the tens place, and the digit five is in the ones place. That's right. Let us see how to read this number. The number in the hundreds place is three. The last two numbers together are read as twenty-five. So the number is three hundred and twenty-five. It is written as this. Notice the sign between twenty and five. It is called a hyphen. It is used for writing the names of numbers that are joined, like twenty-five. Sometimes. Number in one of the place values is a zero. Then let's see how you read them. Consider this number. The number in the hundreds place is four. The digit in the tens place is zero, and the ones digit is six, and it is read as four hundred and six. Since the last two digits are read together. Zero and six together is only six. Now, Amber, can you read this number? Sure. The hundreds digit is six. Tens digit is two, and ones digit is zero. Since the last two digits are read together, the number is read as six hundred and twenty. Very good Amber you answered correctly We saw how to write numbers in words Now let us see how to identify the number given in words Let's see the first number It's 232 200 means the digit in the hundreds place is 2 The digits in the tens and ones place are read together that is 32 So the number is written as this. Now identify the figures for the number given in words, Amber. Seven hundred means the digit in the hundreds place is seven. The digits in the tens and ones place are zero and five. So the number is written as this. You're right, Amber. Let's quickly revise the concepts. You can use the concept of place value to express given number in words. You can also identify the figures for the number given in words.